Hi guys, this is Chris Salins from Bali, Mosaic Restaurant and Spice by Chris Salins. So my earliest uh, memories of food is actually growing up in France with my parents. My grandparents used to have a farmhouse, uh, a country house, a house by the beach, and we would always go picking mushrooms, hiking for wild blueberries, uh, picking shrimp or oysters out of the ocean. This is what made me uh, indirectly become a chef, and that's where my passion for good food comes from. My struggle between what my parents wanted me to do, which was to become a doctor, and what I wanted to do, which when you're young, you don't know what you want to do. You're confused. So the struggle was listening to the parents or listening to my heart. And I always had a passion for eating. And I was thinking, how can I turn my passion for eating into a job? And I became a chef. So why did I choose Bali to be my, my home for my restaurant? To be honest, I fell in love with Bali. That was 20 years ago. I also married an Indonesian, so obviously it was easy for me to end up in Indonesia. But now that I've been living here, I think the Balinese are very special people, unique in the world. And with regards to my food, I think what makes the strength of my food, what makes my food so special, is because of the flavors and the ingredients of Indonesia. I go to the markets, I, I forage, I find ingredients. And it's because of Indonesian ingredients that I am getting so much recognition everywhere in the world. Basically, there are three secrets to a great dish, but I add a fourth one. Our flavor, use good ingredients and you will get a good dish. Color, make sure that the dish is beautiful. And the last one is texture. Make sure that a dish does not have one texture. Put something soft, put something chewy, put something crunchy, put something liquid. You have to make sure that every bite is a different experience. Now there is one more secret that I have in my food, which nobody else has, which is that each and every single one of my dishes is based on an Indonesian ingredient. So there is a lot of colors, flavors, textures, but the secret to mosaic and spice by Chris Salins is the focus on Indonesian flavors and ingredients. Thank you, Chef's Table, and back to Chandra in the kitchen. Okay, tadi kita udah buat yang khas dalam negeri. Sekarang kita akan buat yang khas luar negeri. Nah, biasanya kalau cemilan itu mereka biasa rada-rada berat sih. Salah satunya adalah yang paling terkenal, French fries. Nah, kita akan bikin dari kentang juga, tapi bukan French fries. Nggak tahu apa. Let's start cooking now. Kita akan kupas dulu potato, siapin air. Oke, kita cuci kentangnya. Nah, sekarang kita slice. Jadi kita iris tipis-tipis seperti size coin. Atau nama lain juga bisa disebut sebagai bentuknya scallop, jadi scallop potato. Uh, scallop potato lebih baik kita potongnya jangan terlalu tebal, supaya nanti waktu baking nggak terlalu lama, jadi ya kurang lebih 1 cm, 1 cm cukupnya aja. Kita siapkan bawang bombay, onion slice, slice. Garlic.
Oke. Nah, kita akan panasin sekarang butter. Onion, garlic. Nah, sambil nunggu ini wangi, kita akan siapkan sekarang plate untuk baking. Kita tambahkan salt sekarang. Nutmeg powder. Black pepper. Lalu kita tambahkan tepung terigu. Nah, kita tumis. Ya, tambahkan susu lalu tambahkan kaldu 